Namaskara. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to graph the given line using slope and y intercept. Here the given line is y is equal to negative 3x plus 3. So we are going to graph this given line using slope and y intercept. So first what you have to do is you have to compare this line y is equal to negative 3x plus 3 to the given to the equation y is equal to mx plus c. Compare this to here you can find what is m. m is negative 3. m is nothing but slope. So, which is m is nothing but slope. Slope is negative 3. So, what is c? Compare. Here c is 3. c is y intercept. So, this is y intercept. Now, let's find any two points on the graph. So how to find those two points? So what you have to do is we know slope is nothing but change in y divided by change in x. So slope is given negative 3 so negative 3 is slope is nothing but m. So negative 3 is equal to change in y divided by change in x. Now negative 3 can be written as negative 3 over 1. So change in y is negative 3 and change in x is 1. Now y intercept is given. Y intercept is 3. So let's find y intercept. That is c. C is 3. So this is 3. Y intercept is 3. And change in y is negative 3. So negative 3 means, so it's negative means you have to move down. You have to move down. Negative means you have to move down. Three points. So one, two, three points. You have to move down three points. So this is change in y. And change in x is positive one. So change in x is positive one. So you have to move right to one. Move down three and right one. So to find the another point. So this is another. This is one point and this is another point. So this is one. So here change in y is negative 3. So move down 3 points from the y intercept. So change in x is positive 1. So move to the right 1 point. So we have got 2 points here. So here graph is the straight line connecting, graph is the straight line connecting 0, 3 that is x1, y1. So x1 is 0 and y1 is 3 and x2, y2 is 1, 0. So graph is the straight line connecting. Now you can connect these two points. Straight line connecting 0, 3 and 1, 0. Use the scale or use the ruler to draw a line. Now second problem. Graph this line 
let us line is given y is equal to negative 5x plus 3 using the slope and y intercept again compare the given line to the line of equation y is equal to mx plus c so here m is negative 5 which is slope and c that is y intercept is 3 So slope is change in y divided by change in x. So slope is negative 5 is equal to change in y divided by change in x. So negative 5 can be written as negative 5 over 1. So change in y is negative 5 and change in x is 1. Now let's graph. Here again, c that is y intercept is 3 so this is 3 point change in y change in y is negative 5 when it is negative so you have to move down 5 points let's move down 5 points on the graph from c that is y is an intercept from this point we have to move down 5 points because so this y change in y is negative. So, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then you have to move right to 1. Because x change in x is 1 which is positive. So we have to move right where 1 is. Now you can draw a straight line. Connecting these two points you can draw a straight line connecting these two points so this is our y is equal to this line is our y is equal to minus 5x plus 3 so this is our y is equal to minus 5x plus 3 here x1 y1 can be taken as 0 3 and x2, y2 can be taken as 1, negative 2. 1 and negative 2. So this is 1, this is point P or you can call as P1. This point 2 is P2. You can see here x1 is 1. So x2 is 1. And y2 is negative 2. Let's go to question number 3. Graph the line y is equal to 7x plus 2 using slope and y intercept. Again, compare the given line y is equal to 7x plus 2 to line of equation y is equal to mx plus c, where m is slope. Slope is given as 7 and y intercept c is 2. So slope is change in y divided by change in x. So slope is 7. So 7 is equal to change in y divided by change in x. So 7 can be written as 7 over 1. So change in y is 7 and change in x is 1. Now let's graph. Graph. So here y intercept is 2. Let's find 2 on the graph. So this is 2. Change in y is 7 which is positive. So you have to move up 7 points from y intercept 2. From this point you have to move up because change in y is positive. So let's move up 7 points. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So this is our y. Then change in x is 1 which is positive. So move right 1. So somewhere. So 1 we can find here. So this is our 1. If you draw a line so this is our y. 1. Now let's draw. 
so this is y intercept and this is one more point draw a line we have got two points so you have to draw a straight line use a ruler it's passing to these two points you have to draw a straight line so this is our straight line y is equal to 7x plus 2 so this is our p1 which is 0 2 the other point is p2 p2 is 1 so here x coordinate is 1 and y coordinate you can find here 9 so p2 is 1 and 9 this is our the straight line is 7x plus 2 so you can try these two y is equal to minus 6x plus 5 and y is equal to 9x minus 5 try these two graph these two using slope and y intercept See you in the next video. Bye-bye.